have some special guests here for this weekend's Arts Avenue. New this morning, we are learning about music from around the world. It's a program called Proyecto Bembe. I said that right, right? Yes. Yes, okay, here to talk about it is Joanna De Los Santos from Milwaukee Public Theater. Joanna, thank you very much for joining well, thank us. Thank you for having me. Okay, so um, pardon my bad Spanish, but tell us what Proyecto Bembe is all about. It's not bad, you're just, everyone has to give, give it their best shot and give it and I took try. I took French in high school, that's my excuse. So. Yeah, so a Proyecto, Proyecto Bembe there is, is the name of the program. <laughs> it's a program of the Milwaukee Public Theater, which is a, a wonderful organization. We've been around 42 years in, in Milwaukee and providing a, arts programming, performances that focuses on arts access and also self-representation in communities throughout Milwaukee. So Proyecto Bembe was founded a couple years ago. Um, the, the purpose of the program is really to um, provide opportunities for young people on the south side of Milwaukee mm. to explore um, <clears throat> the connections of Africa and Latin America through music. It's an ethnomusicology program. Gotcha. So they're learning about the histories and, and cultures of Latin America and, and West Africa and the influences and exchanges between the two through percussion and dance. Gotcha. And you get people moving, you get the kids playing instruments here, right. and they're really learning a lot, not only about the music from all, you know, all over the world, but really about themselves through all of this as well. Oh, absolutely. This is about identity exploration. The youth, the ages we work with primarily for the performance group are four through eight. And so during that time in a kid's life, they are really exploring their identity. So if a youth we're working with does identify, does self-identify as a Latino or an African American, mm -hmm. it is about identity exploration. But if, if a youth we're working with does not self-identify as one of those, they still are able to explore all of those influences on American culture, um, which is like, you know, African music is the foundation of so much of America, American, Latin American culture. Um, but it's also about giving uh, youth the opportunity to connect and have positive um, emotional and experiential connections to African culture because it is an underrepresented culture right. in, in the West, and you know, what in our a, part of the world. What a positive way to just, you know, grab, you know, music does so much for us right. and, and the lessons that these kids have. Uh, well, and percussion is really good at that because yeah. we're rhythmic people. Right. Even if we don't feel that way, everything in our bodies and our seasons and our lives are rhythmic. So really, even though percussion is, you can become very advanced with technique, Really, anyone can be a drummer. Absolutely. So this is a very accessible art form for any youth, especially youth that are maybe a little hyper, uh, have sure. a hard time focusing. Sure. This really grounds them and gets them uh, centered and Sounds focused. Sounds great. What yeah. a great way to spend with children. Joanna, thank you very much. Oh, thank you. All right, for more information on Pro Proyecto Bembe, go to our website, wisn.com slash weekend. We'll be right back with another great segment in our Arts Avenue.